A very good evening to you all. Honorable guest, respected members of TMBG Bangalore, and my dear friends. First of all, heartiest congratulations to all the members and volunteers of TMPG Bangalore for organizing the fourth edition of Kankin Kabang 2021. An exemplary celebration of the missing youth, it is because of the relentless effort and hard work of the designated members that we are being able to be part of this event tonight. It gives me immense pride to see that TMPK Bangalore blossoms into such a mature organization since its inception back in 2018. Like its parent Kabang, TMPK Bangalore has been working for the socio-economic upliftment of the society of Bangalore. I really appreciate that most of our missing youth have migrated to Bangalore mainly for the purpose of work. And our members have always supported and guided through good and bad times. And I feel extremely blessed to be part of this event tonight. And that's the reason we have gathered here to symbolize the brotherhood and unity that exists amongst us. Historically, missing community being the second largest tribal group of Northeast India has always supported a democratic organization like the Kabang. It is the prime social cultural institution of the youth that tends to attain social education and life experiences. It always stood as a symbol of unity, integrity, and assimilation. And these are the most beautiful aspects of our society, and I feel proud and privileged to be born and raised in it. And what inspire and admire me the most is the equality of status given to every individual, including women in our society. Our forefathers and elders have always taught us to be respectful and guided to follow the path of righteousness. So I would like to urge our senior leaders and to keep a vigilant eye so that pet differences do not tend to exist in our unity and keep reminding ourselves of what tradition we belong to and also the richness of our culture. Well, I have been residing in Bangalore for the last couple of years and I have known most of the members individually and I can assure in heart no one is evil. However, differences in opinion are always bound to appear in any form of organization. But apart from them, we have to respect each other, we have to guide either, uh, each other and support each other. Well, I'm extremely blessed to be part of this event tonight. Time has been very challenging and difficult this couple of years as we are battling pandemic, which has affected so many of us in so many ways. Being away from our friends, our families, and not being able to interact with them has been one of the most difficult challenges. The toll taken by the loss of job, unemployment, and facing financial and economic crisis amongst our missing youth have been monumental not to mention the pain endured to those who have lost their loved ones during these hours of crisis. My heart and prayers go out to all the bereaved people who have suffered an imaginable loss during this time. Let us take a moment and remind ourselves how fortunate we are 
to be able to enjoy each other company and how every day is a blessing and every meal is a gift from God. Above all, I would also like to mention about the maintenance of physical and uh, mental well-being. Well, we cannot hope to achieve anything in life without a sound mind and a healthy body. In the past couple of years, few unfortunate incidents that happened among the missing youth who have lost their lives due to ill health and mental pressure. We should always remember the reason why we have come here. Away from our homes and families, it is only because of the betterment of our own lives, our families, and also for the development of our society. So, dear friends, we should always keep in mind the importance of health. This is what we always have to remember, the reason why we have come here. So, uh, I would also like to mention one of uh, our TMPK member, Mr. Rajiv Pegu, who has been an inspiration to many of us regarding physical uh, well-being. I personally so much motivated seeing his video of doing yoga, which he had posted in the social media. And I think we should always, you know, try to uh, inspire from all these small, small uh, things. And in the past couple of years, our members have organized committee activity like uh, uh, outing, and also sports activity like football and uh, cricket. And I would also like to encourage every one of you to take, uh, f uh, to take active participation and also uh, uh, take care of your health. And at least uh, uh, take out at least minimum of 30 minutes of your daily routine so that you can keep your health better. And also, I would like to request every one of you to get vaccinated, stay safe, and stay healthy. Uh, finally, a word of thanks to all the honorable guests for your gracious present, and also spending some time with us. Your company being here will definitely benefit many of us are missing youth in the near future. Oroka rangam nolu aglu yoka ngo English pa ludo ngam na. Nolu adidi nam so Bangalore so dung ampila nolu English dem ajo koda gum bujiru dupa. Bujida gay? Kapil bujima mai. So inu taniyong dung. Ampila oroka nolu ayo nolu hoddi ko moto pa so ager laga ngo gudung. Okay, okay. Poisa panamong na sakuriyo gairung om na poisa om sin panam dama odok ka ngolu airu pa om sin kinpa lagi ta ngolu kapa abu nam kapa honman panamazi kapa agumam luposu bana pazi arum sin ngol kinpa lagi ta odok ka airu ma podum sampa ngolu apu nga gukum sula lako pa ma pol dula ka aru angku na kangkin ka badu sin ako ruk sula pa once again Heartiest congratulations to all the uh, TMPK members and volunteers for organizing this beautiful event. And I hope in the next coming days, there will be more grand celebration. Thank you. Borka pe goodbye kolo pe ngolu. Asin ki asengam saligdum. Big motivations, encouragement, ngolum. Support nam lagava. Ngolu Bangalore missing rangama. Kapa Turpanaman, Kapa Dupanaman.
pandemic air do ngolu kapa turton kapa duton de takama gomem ngolum luiram luto dok lega pe bekolo pe ngolu asin asengam selik do